All right, this video is for all you out there that don't really know how to work out. You might as well call this video "Working Out Bodybuilding for Dummies." <laughs> for real. All right, so check this out. I'm gonna break working out down into three the three most important steps: working out, eating right, and sleeping right. Now you guys might as well you guys might look on the internet or somewhere and see that it says oh proper nutrition or some fancy term, but I'm breaking this down for the people that that don't have the fancy terms and don't really know what the fuck they're, fuck they're doing in the gym or whatever. And this, this is almost like an analogy. All right, whatever the, whatever the case may be, whether you're trying to get stronger, bigger, faster, whatever it is, you're squatting, you're benching, your shoulder, your back's calves, whatever the case may be, when you work out, you wanna make sure you are working out really, really hard. Because if you're not, if you're just in the gym just dicking around like, oh yeah, do this, about eight, do this, do that, you ain't gonna get shit done. You wanna make sure your workout is really, really intense. You know what I'm saying? Because imagine this being your muscle, right? Your muscle is intact. When you work out really, really hard, you're tearing up your muscles. Your muscles are tearing just like that. You see those like little see-through things in my hands, whatever the spaces? Imagine those being the tears in your body. Man, imagine it like when you were go to the gym working out really hard, whatever you're doing, imagine a big landfill full of bricks. That's what happens when you when you when you work out really, really hard, you just have a dump truck just coming in and loading up the bricks. It's because that's your muscles getting tore up and needed to be put back together and built back stronger. And after you do all that, tear your muscles up, the next thing is eating right. When you eat, you need the, the protein, the nutrients, the vitamins. You hear it all the time wherever you go. Man, just eat a lot, you guys. Make sure you're make sure you're bulking up. You you hear it all the time that you need to that you need to eat right. So here you already got that. So one, you got your working out right. You're in the gym, you hit you're hitting it real hard, whatever you're doing, not slacking, real intense, you're tearing up those muscles. Two, you need the food. You need all that protein and the nutrients and the amino acids in your system getting there. And imagine the food like workers. Like the food are the workers that are coming up to build up these bricks. Hence, build up this muscle that you just tore up that needs to be built back stronger. You don't, you don't want to do all that work to your body, get out of the gym and eat a piece of candy. Eat some gum. Oh, I want to have a chocolate bar. No, you don't want to do that shit. Because imagine these workers. Imagine you got low class workers and high class workers. The people that's going to build on your muscle, build up these bricks and build them back stronger. You know what I'm saying? If you, if you are eating dumb shit all day, Fast food, candy, chips, you know, you working out saying, oh, I eat everything, blah, 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 blah. Imagine those workers like five-year-olds or, or fucking convicts in jail that got no degree and nothing. They're going to come up to your stuff and be like, all right, yeah, we're about to build some muscle. We're about to build up these bricks. We don't know what the fuck we're doing, but that's what we're about to do. You know what I'm saying? That's all the wrong food. You don't want you don't want you don't want that guy working on your shit. You want a guy, alright, let's say your house just had a big ass fire, half of it's knocked the fuck down. And you want this house, right? Your insurance is gonna pay for it to fix it. Do you want some people off the street just saying, yeah man, we can fix your house for like five to five, ten thousand dollars? Hell no. You don't want that shit. Anybody, anybody that tells me, man, what you do when you work, what you, what you eat when you work out? Oh man, I eat everything. You want all that stuff? Man, fuck that. That's bullshit. And if they is doing that, they ain't getting where they could have been. Because when you eat the right food, picture your worker like in a suit and tie. I just graduated college. Look, man, I got five degrees to build up this muscle and build up these bricks. That's the type of food you want. That's like your your white rice. That's like your your broccoli, your vegetables, your vitamins, your your chicken, your whole whole wheat breast chicken, whatever whatever it may be. You you already know your eggs, all that. I don't have to explain that. But you want those type of foods because those are going to be the type of workers that are working on your muscle and going to build them up right. You want them fresh out of college, just graduated, did five million internships. They're ready to go and build this muscle up straight. That's why you need the right foods. Because if you get the wrong food, you're going to have a two-year-old on a little bicycle saying, Hey, can I build up that for you? Can I, can, can I build that house up? It looks fun to do. Man, he ain't gonna know what the fuck he doing. And if he do do it, he ain't gonna do that shit right. You ain't gonna build shit. You might build like two little bricks versus the guy that just graduated high school. He gonna build your shit like that. Just boom. That's how it goes. That's why you need the right food, man. Now you already, you already, you worked out right. You're, you're starting to eat right now. You got all the workers. And now the reason why you need to sleep 
is because these, the food needs to build the muscle. And you don't build muscle when you're out of the gym, when you're in the gym. You build muscle when you're sleeping. Primarily, that's when you build muscle, when you are sleeping. That's why it's so important because I think about it like, all right, you got the bricks, that's your muscle tore up. You got the workers, that's the food. Now the workers are waiting for you to go to sleep. They're waiting for that eight hour shift of you sleeping so they can start building up the muscles. Because that's when you build muscle primarily is in your sleep. You know, you got all these guys sitting around waiting on, all right, right when we go to sleep, we're about to start working on these muscles. So that's, that's what you want to look at working out as. You work out really, really hard. You tear up the muscles. You, you get the right food in them. You got the, the bricks thrown down. You got the workers ready and you need to sleep because that's when they start working. That's when they start building on your muscles is when you are sleeping. You don't build muscle in the, when you work out and, and you're just tearing up your muscles. You're just creating work for your food that goes in your body to build up the muscles. But they need to go to work when you sleep. You gotta, you gotta sleep. You gotta get a hell of a lot of sleep. You ain't gotta get that much sleep, but it's good if you get enough sleep because then you get enough time for these workers to get their eight-hour shift and back thing, vice versa. You know what I'm saying? And that's my analogy on working out.